Welcome to Wilderness Wanderers. If you're new to our channel, why don't you hit that like button and consider subscribing. Today, we are at the Oregon Pipe Cactus National Monument. And we're hiking up to the Arch Rock up there and we're on the Arch Canyon Trail. You can see that rock right there? That's, we're gonna go up there and have lunch. Here we go. Follow me to the sunshine. Come and see what it feels like. Welcome to episode four of Arizona Adventures. We are now four miles from the Mexican-U.S. border in Oregon Pipe Cactus National Monument. And as you can see, it is the middle of nowhere. We began the day on the Ajo Mountain Drive Loop Road, which takes you to some great trailheads. Today, we're doing the Arch Rock hike, but if you'd just like to do this drive, we have an upcoming video showing the highlights of this stunning road trip. I was just commenting on the shoes that I wore today, down here. <laughs> He's in his trail shoes. I'm in my trail shoes too. We don't have our big boots on. You're in your trail shoes. I tell him off for tapping his poles. So now he's gonna tap his poles on purpose. Only when we talk about trail shoes. And I'm wearing my Nathan pack. Kev's got his T-ton on. We're going up there. Oh my gosh. I can't even with this. Winterland, tell me all your secrets. Fill me in on your wildest moments. Color trees, your yellow leaves move me. They just Okay guys, we've come across the smuggler's trail. So part of this trail in the National Monument goes this way. It says Arch Canyon Trail this way and there's a sign going that way meaning you can go and explore that way but be aware of your surroundings and where you're going. Of a mountain. Live on top of this rock. We just came up this steep part. There's no trail anymore. The rocks you've been looking at on our GoPro shots and on our pictures. Yeah, now we're hiking up those. Shit. Tim's lovely wife waited where the trail ends and the hiking route begins. 
Tim's extremely fit and we assume not afraid of heights. He was also very thoughtful and we'll share why in a little while. The camera never really captures just how steep this truly is. What the hell am I doing here? This is sketchy as I need you out of Egyptian sand. Remember Tim? He was kind enough to take a photograph of us from his highest vantage point. He told us later that we managed to go higher than he did. That's us down in the canyon. He's now one of our subscribers. Thank you, Tim. Well, guys, we got, I would say, probably 85% of the way there. So we're standing on a section that's reasonably safe right now but kevin has got a, a firm hold of me we had a bit of a, a bit of a panic attack and we waited and we didn't get all the way to the arch very steep and rocky and sheer and terrifying so now we're gonna make our way back down but here i'll let you see where we're going see the arch up there we're about 100 feet about below that as you can see it's way too steep on this side to go up it's just as bad on the back side too but there's kind of a trail that just goes straight up the side of the mountain when it gets steep it is steep yeah and you can see it's rock it's not like this it's not like the ground here it's just rock and that's what we were trying to get up on the other side it's a great walk up the canyon though about our age and they have this amazing ATV RV. I will put a picture in there. They did not make it either. The trail itself is just 1.2 miles into the canyon. At this point, it changes to a hiking route marked by Karens that ascends 800 feet in a half a mile to the arch. We didn't make it. But we sure hope you enjoyed this video. If so, hit that like button so YouTube knows. Thank you to our subscribers. If you're not one of our subscribers, we drop new videos every Wednesday and Saturday. From Cat and Kev, your wilderness wanderers, we'll see you on the trail. Yeah.